Hey guys, Brooke Whipple here. Welcome to my channel. It's day 20, 20 days. Day 20 of the 28 day challenge to get out every day and have a campfire. It's a beautiful day, it's a bit windy. And I always come here when it's windy. It's a little protected here. Got lots of pines and hemlock. It's just a gorgeous winter scene here. Today on the campfire, I'm cooking a bacon sausage ham scramble. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna blow your face off. Ladies and gentlemen, start your fires. going anywhere else baby this is it settle in she hates to stop wants to keep going Lauren she's a girl after my own heart that's a beauty Oh man, you guys, I am so hungry, ready for food. Get that pan going. Get some butter in there. You're not gonna believe the goodness today. It all starts with butter and then it gets better with bacon and sausage and ham and veggies and potatoes and then eggs and then hot sauce. Let's get some butter going. Butter makes the world better. All right, here we go. All the goodness is going in at once. Hope, hope my pan doesn't get overloaded. It's a lot, a lot of food. Yeah, baby. <laughs> we got all the goodness in there. I made uh, baked potatoes the other night. We had some leftovers, so those are diced up. These potatoes are, are already cooked. We got sausage, bacon, and ham in there. Red bell peppers, onions, and jalapenos. Oh yeah. Hello. How you doing, honey? Such a good girl. Such a good girl. All right, it's time. Sweet coffee. Ooh, she gone. Oh, I blacked out there for a minute. <laughs> Can you blame me? These smells, these sights, these smells. Oh, man. Yeah, we're getting somewhere here. Looking good. Okay, here's your Mary Oliver poem for today. The fox is sitting on a sandy rise. <laughs> the fox is sitting on a sandy rise. It is looking at me. It yawns, the pickets of its teeth glitter. It scratches under its jaw, rises, and in slow, haunchy nonchalance, leaps over the slopes of sand, then down a path, walking, then trotting. Then it sprints into the shadows under the trees as if into water and is gone. I can just see that whole scene play out in my head when I read those words. It's pretty cool. Smell that? Onions and green peppers and sausage and ham. Oh, I think it's time. It's time for coffee. It's starting to brown up so nicely. You can smell all that goodness cooking. A little creamer. A little stir stick. Completely disposable stir stick. Ah, cheers guys, that's delicious. I think we're ready for the eggs. Just gonna pour the eggs right into the mix. Mm. It's looking good. Right, we need some cheese. The other thing I want on here, Salsa. Gotta have some hot sauce. Salt and pepper. 
And this might surprise you, but put a little sour cream in the middle. It Sour cream is perfect for these. Actually, this is Greek yogurt, which tastes just like sour cream. That is an amazing looking meal. Holy cow. But first, before I eat, we gotta get Maisie her food. She's gonna have chicken and beef stew with rice and carrots. You want that? Gourmet food for the puppers. You like that? That. There's a breakfast for you. All right, guys, look at this. Oh, that's a miracle. <laughs> Breakfast skillet with ham, bacon, sausage, eggs, peppers, jalapenos, onions. You smell that? Dear Lord, thank you for this cold, crisp winter day. The fact that I can have a fire, I can get out and enjoy your creation. Thank you for this food. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, let's dig into this. Potatoes. First bite, open up. <laughs> Here we go. Oh wow. It's like a flavor explosion. I think I might need some more hot sauce. I think the best way to enjoy food in the winter is out of a cast iron pan because it's going to keep it, it keeps it warm. Otherwise, really hard to keep stuff hot. Oh wow, this is delicious. I need more hot sauce. That's more like it. When you finally get all the cooking done, you can sit around a fire. That's the real reward. Eat some food, stare at the fire. Well guys, that's gonna do it for me. <laughs> I eat that whole thing. I'm stuffed. Oh, it's so good. Mm. I hope today you're gonna get outside and go for a walk or make fire or cook some amazing food over a fire or all of the above. Turn off your phones, turn off your electronics, get outside and get happy. It's gonna make you feel so much better. It's gonna clear your head, lower your anxiety, lower your stress, chill you out. Trust me, food and a campfire, and just being outside, it's gonna make you feel better. This has been day 20 of the 28 day challenge to get outside every day and have a fire. Amazing skillet breakfast. Hope I can walk out of here. I'm gonna have to roll back. Maybe Maisie, oh I could hook up Maisie to my sled. She could pull me back. Maisie, come here girl. Here comes my ride. <laughs> Good girl, all right. All right guys, that's gonna do it for me. This girl in the woods, she gone. Oh, and don't forget to get outside and get happy. Yeah, you ready to take me home? Come on, come on. She's attacking, she's attacking me. 